Guys, now we should ask ourselves are we going to believe all things that we find on Google or what, what's the truth? What's the truth, right? So, we, we know actually that Burundi is not the poorest country in the world. So, guys, we have Mozambique, Madagascar, Sierra Leone, Afghanistan, yes. uh, Libya, yes. Niger, Democratic Republic of Congo. How can Congo? We are so far. This is let me see. Even Uganda may appear. <laughs> okay. This is another one. Everything shows difference. And and Burundi is is not even in the list. In the list. Yeah. But this one says that it's Burundi. Burundi. So Why? what should we believe? Which, which one is right yeah. and which one is yeah. wrong? <laughs> so guys, which one should we believe? But me, I think Burundi is not the poorest country in the world. Yeah, the that's the truth. Because of the beauty of the people. Yeah, <laughs> the love of the people and I think People are so happy here, so I think yeah. Burundi is not the poorest country in the whole world. Please, stop saying that, okay? Yes, thank you. I will share the video, because that's true. <laughs> so Burundians say their country is not the poorest country. It's not the poorest country, but it's a good country. Yes, a good country. But it's not poor. <laughs> Burundi is a landlocked country found in the Great Rift Valley in East Africa with a population of 12 million people who are made up of the Twa, Hutu and Tutsi. It gained its independence from German in 1962. The education in Burundi is free and taught mainly in Kirundi and French. Languages mainly spoken is Kirundi, French and Swahili. I fell in love with the Burundi flag which has three colors, white, green and red. And each color represents something. White represents peace, green represents the nation's hopes placed on future development, red symbolizes the suffering of the nation during its freedom struggle and the three stars stand for the three ethnic groups of Burundi. It is said to be one of the poorest countries in the world with subsistence farmers making up to 90% of the population. The economy of Burundi is heavily dependent on agriculture. It is said that Burundi's economy was already weakened following the 2015 political crisis that led to the withdrawal of most external aid. However much it is said to be one of the poorest countries in the whole world but me as Miss Josie I don't think Burundi is poor because of the beautiful people are uh, the smiling faces and the nature that Burundi has Welcome to Burundi. Huh? Welcome to Burundi. Yes, welcome to Burundi. <laughs> <laughs> one of the biggest city here in Burundi uh, right now we are coming from uptown and we're heading to downtown welcome to Burundi <laughs> you have to cross Uh, 
I really love Bujumbura. First, because uh, it is in the middle of uh, these beautiful mountains, uh, which makes it a beautiful town. Of course, I don't know how to speak Kirundi. I don't know how to speak French. I don't know how I'm gonna interact with people, but I'm going to be trying my best. But at least I know some Kirundi words. Omejute, 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 omejute means hi or hello. So those are the I, I know a few words, and uh, some words are similar to my language. So I try to try my best to fit in and. Uh, interview a few people by the way this is i just met this guy on the way so uh he was going to town so i decided to come with him and yo <laughs> so let me turn the camera and i show you how bujumbura looks like it's very good yeah it's very good yeah. <laughs> this is in town in town This side. The way for to go, the bank here. Ah, this one, eh? The green one. Ah, yeah, the so green. you're stopping from here? Yeah. Okay, me, I'll continue. So what, what, there's no problem. Yeah. Okay, okay. Go from way. This way, take it easy. Ah, no so problem. this is downtown. The one, yeah. yeah. Ah. This is the way for to go town. This is another another bus stop there. Ah. For to go, the bus go Kanyosha mm. and the and the and the Musaga ah. and so on. Okay, it yeah. was nice meeting you. Okay, thank you. Thank you so much. And you too. Say hi to my people. Hi, hi. <laughs> <laughs> okay, bye. <laughs> so yeah, people are nice here. And uh, that's what I can say. He has been so helpful. Kirundi, uh, French, Swahili. Uh, and no Swahili. Swahili. No, I don't know Swahili. Oh, I know. among those uh, <laughs> Ugandans who don't speak Swahili. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> You are from where exactly? I'm from Western Uganda. Western Uganda. Yeah. Okay. That's good. There are some Ugandans we, where, where they speak uh, Kinyamole. Kinyamole is, I don't know. Kenya. That's language. Fumbira. Chifumbira. Which is, which is sound like uh, Kirundi. That is Kifumbira. Ah. We walk back to town at 6 p.m. Oh. People are so many. Yeah. What? I'm going to get a SIM card. Wow. Sorry. Is it true what they say that uh, Burundi is the poorest country in the world? No, I don't think. You don't think? It depends that uh, what you call poor is what because we are a rich country yeah. mm -hmm. yeah. with many people. <laughs> That's also the yeah, yeah, thing. yeah. Mm -hmm. And also um, we have uh, good places and also we have good food. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you disagree with that? Yeah. I'm happy. <laughs> but you have many resources. You have a lot of resources. Yes. Yeah. So if you have resources in Burundi, that means that you, the country itself is rich. It's, the country itself is rich, but the, the leadership. people, they don't know how to manage it and how to, to develop the resources so that we can uh, provide for ourselves and also for the country so that they, the country can be more rich. Mm. Yeah. Ah. Uh, I think Burundi is not poor, but the leadership yes. matters. Yes. Most African countries are poor because of leadership. Yeah. So, yo, <laughs> oh, African leaders, don't come for me. <laughs> Especially Burundians. Yeah, please don't come for me. Yeah. Don't come for me. <laughs> it's like a challenge. Yeah. Yeah, try to, 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 to manage it well so that we can be the, the country or among the richest countries. In, in, in the whole world. Yes. Yeah. Because it's possible yeah it is if it's what possible we have. Mm. yeah German and Burundi 
Actually, I heard that you guys are facing uh, issue of sugar in the yes. country that you don't have enough sugar. A really problem, mm -hmm. and and I don't know why because we have we have uh, a company mm -hmm. which produces the sugar. Yeah. But I don't know, maybe they send the sugar to you? <laughs> no! In Uganda, yeah. we have uh, a lot of companies that produce sugar. Oh, that's so we why. never run out of sugar. We, we, we have one company only. That produces so, sugar. Yeah, yeah. So my, like those guys, when they told me where I sleep, yeah. They told me that they have issue of sugar, so yes. they can't give me sugar. Yes. I was like, yo! <laughs> oh, if you found one kg, mm -hmm. you found it very expensive. Like at how much? 5,000. Frambo, yes. Brilliant Frambo. Yeah. Ah, okay. Yes. And it's very expensive because before we used to, to buy it at uh, 2,000. Two Frambo? Yes. Mm -hmm. But now it's, it's like it's double. It's yeah. double. Yeah. Oh my. That's the problem. Sugar inflation yes. in Burundi. Yes. <laughs> what? And That's... we have some people who have uh, sugar, but they don't want to give it. They don't want to give it yes. to you guys. Yes. Like neighboring Unless countries? You... No, no, not neighbor countries. Here in Burundi, mm. they don't want to give it. Or they told you that unless you buy something else, mm -hmm. then we, we we have the sugar, and ah. also to the higher price. Ah. Yes. Or they yes. wait, they wait so that you they you can buy it after. Ah. Yes. So is it like the first time you guys are having that uh, issue? No, it's not the first time. Ah. Yeah. So you normally have that issue yeah. of sugar. And even I heard about fuel, like you guys, you there is a time like you go totally out of fuel. Yes, yes, yes. And you don't know the causes. That's the what? problem. Oh my, yeah. that's crazy. Yes. In Uganda, we've never had a problem of sugar. Fuel and fuel also. Fuel, yeah, we have fuel. Yeah. Just that right now, like it's so high. Yes. I think because of the Russian and yeah. the but Ukraine the war. In Burundi is that even if you have that money you can you can not found it mm -hmm. like you have five uh from book mm -hmm. to buy sugar but you don't know where to yeah, go to buy it like there is no sugar totally yeah, yes what? or some places but it's for some people some rich other, yeah. some rich people they or the, no not only the rich but some people like you know or your clients uh, yeah your customers so they they book it. Yeah, they book it for some people. For some people. Yeah. Oh my God. So Burundi is facing sugar issues. Yes. You should come to Uganda and we give you sugar. <laughs> we have a lot of sugar in yeah, Uganda. True. <laughs> true. We have a lot of companies that produce but sugar. I think it's not so sweet like uh, our sugar. It's really sweet like your sure. sugar. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> So I'm you going should to taste our sugar, and then we are going to compare it. <laughs> it with your Ghana oh, sugar. Okay. <laughs> so you should come to Uganda. I'll yes. give you a lot of cages. Yes. <laughs> wait. Oh my. You wait. Yes. Oh, you wait. oh. Oh, for the. <laughs> yes. I'm used the to new the. One. I'm used. I'm used to the Ugandan way. Just yeah. go. <laughs> Even here in Burundi, mm -hmm. sometimes if you wait for that. Some Burundians we, we, we see you as uh, someone who don't have somewhere to go ah. because you're wasting your time here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. that's true. But for me, I, I like. May to I just wait. go? I'm leaving, guys. You're so sad. Oh my Thank god. Mm, it, it was yeah. really nice to meet you. You guys, you know I how in, in, in Burundi they, they greet people by giving pet. I mean, yes. And that's crazy. <laughs> and also a big hug. And also a big hug. Yes. Aww. <laughs> yes. I'll see you on Sunday. Yes, yeah. when we talk on WhatsApp. Okay. Bye bye. Bye. You have not introduced yourself. I'm Elsie. I'm Burundian. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, guys, bye. She's going away. Feel so yes. sad. I'll see you again. Not so. We we'll promise. You. Yes. Okay. Okay. Bye. Bye. Okay. Bye. See you. <laughs> that actually that was nice of her. Guys here are so friendly, like I met her in the bank, uh, my ATM couldn't work in their bank, so uh, she helped me out, she, she moved with me to their biggest bank, and after we didn't get what we wanted, then uh, 
uh, she took me to another bank and finally my ATM worked in that bank and then we became friends yeah it's like we've known each other like for weeks or months that's that's amazing she's so sweet so that's the reason why I'm loving Burundi people are so friendly here in Burundi I'm loving it but anyways yeah I'm, I'm still moving around I want to show you uh, different places as I told you while I was starting this video I'm going to be showing you around Bujumbura uh, Bujumbura is one of the biggest town here in Burundi so yeah let's continue Josie, what is your name? Megan. Megan? And her? Yeah. Eh? Lohia. Lohia? Yeah. Oh, French names are hard to pronounce. Are these French names? Uh, Lohia? Lohia. 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 Yeah. And? Megan. Megan. <laughs> so you're from school? Yeah. In which class are you? Uh, the premier class. One first. First on the motor is no like in which class like high school or primary high school. you're in high school yeah ah okay so you 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 like uh your classes end at this time it's what it's mid it's midday they end at midday your lessons like school here ends at midday ah interesting <laughs> final destination and uh, I don't know it's like that there are no enough buses or taxis in Bujumbura so a lot of people are waiting for buses and taxis in Bujumbura there are few buses or taxis and people are so many so uh, you can find that in a taxi they are sitting they are putting four four people or even five five so all those people are waiting for buses all those people are waiting for buses to go inside wow <laughs> this one is the bus is not going anywhere so I don't know <laughs> wow this one is the bus wow there are a few buses here and people are fighting for them as you saw it's not gonna be possible for me to get a bus and border borders are not allowed in the city center 
So I don't know what I'm gonna do. I'm going to sleep in town today. Oh my god, I don't know what I'm going to do because all these guys are waiting for buses. So I don't know. But uh, let me try plan B or C. I, I see if I can get somehow I can go I can go home. So it starts from there and it turns all the way this side. It's really a long queue. What? Oh my god. How are you? How are you? price is right if they don't take back the product then uh, that price was wrong so I told the lady because she told me that it is 3,000 uh, Burundi, Burundi, Burundi money then I was like no me I don't have 3,000 I have 1,000 but then uh, she had to keep the product she had to keep the bananas so that means that that was the right price 